Marco Diaz to the principal's office. Marco Diaz to the principal's office. Ooh, looks like someone's in trouble. So, I guess everyone who voted me safest kid must be feeling pretty embarrassed right about now. Do I need a hall pass? Would you just go already? Ugh. Marco! I want you to meet our new foreign exchange student, Star Butterfly. <laughs> huh? I need a responsible, never-take-chances type to keep an eye on her. And who better than you, the safe kid? What? No, 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 no. I am completely wrong for this. I'm a misunderstood bad boy. You're adorable. Now I'm off to the ice cream shop. Daddy's getting all 52 flavors. <sighs> Thanks for showing me around, safe kid. What? No. Whatever you heard about me isn't true. Hi. I don't know where people get the idea I'm so safe. Oh, watch your step, loose tile. It's ridiculous. Careful. You wear a helmet in the gym shower one time and you're labeled for life. Oh, broken glass. Frankly, I like taking risks and would welcome a little danger in my life. What the heck was that? Oops. <laughs> I thought you wanted a little danger. Who are you? I'm a magical princess from another dimension. Welp, that brings us to the end of our tour. I'm going home now. Bye, new friends! See you tomorrow! It's clear. Ooh, escaping is inappropriate. Guards! Shh. Guards! Guards! Yoo-hoo, guards! Hey, guards! Keep your hickeys at 90 degrees. More tea, please. Keep your pinkies at 90 degrees. More tea, please. Keep your pinkies at 90 degrees. This is worse than my worst nightmare. Yeah, I see what you mean. Keep your pinkies at 90 degrees. Why are you saying that? You don't even have pinkies! Come on! Keep your pinkies at 90 degrees. More tea, please. Keep your pinkies at 90 He's right on us! Are we gonna blast our way out of this? No, that'll only increase the heat on us. We need some kind of distraction. Well, they are not getting my individuality. That's it! Keep It's not criminal! To be an individual. Come on! It's not criminal to be an individual. It's not criminal to be an individual. It's not criminal to be an individual. That should buy us some time. To be an individual. T. He got scalded. She's laughing at an authority figure. I think the real pony head still in there. Star. Star! Star! Get out of here! This place is the worst! That dance was meant for me! Walk it out. Hello. No, right! Ah! Let's go, Marco. Thanks for the lift. Ooh, so infuriating. I hate to say it, but I warned you about Tom. No, 
You! You're infuriating! Me? I was just trying to help. You don't trust me to do things by myself. I'm 14. I can handle a demon. I know you're trying to look out for me, but you have to let me figure things out on my own. I don't need a hero. I need a friend. <sighs> you're right. I should have trusted you. I'm sorry I ruined your night. Well, it wasn't a total disaster. Now I know you can dance. <laughs> Hat, Hat hair. hair. Whoa! Whoa we, we both said, said the, the same, same thing. thing. Okay, okay, stop, stop that. that. <laughs> 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 well, that was new. Yeah, weird. Now go make me some nachos. Okay. Mr. Diaz, I've been very anxious to speak to you. Seen my test scores, have you? Indeed. Garbage Island? What's the use of taking honors classes if it gets you sent to the middle of nowhere? So don't go. At least you have a choice. Apparently, the only thing in my future is being queen. Ah, oh, man, I'd love to be queen. Mm. You never have to think about what to wear. You have somebody do that for you. Aww. People would just love you because they have to, no matter how weird you are. Ugh. You never have to bathe alone. Mm, Marco, please stop talking. Head <laughs> janitor, garbage island. <laughs> I'll come back later. All right, sir. Phase one is complete. What's next? Sir, are you there? You idiot! You forgot the most important part! Me! I got confirmation! Starko was completely platonic. Starko? Make sure there's no possibility of them ever being a thing. Absolutely, sir. Also, stop offering everyone candy. You're gonna blow my cover. I want her back. I gotta go. I'm not done. No. You don't understand. I gotta go. Flush me first. Hey, Mr. Candle. Oh. oh, hello, Marco. I appreciate all your guidance with Garbage Island and all, but I'm gonna pass. Actually, I was just thinking I might be king of Muni. <laughs> what? The thing is, Star and I have recently become smooch buddies. On the lips. Even if that's true, kid, you shouldn't say that out loud. Yeah, we've been trying all styles. German, Italian, Polynesian. My tonsils are so tired. I can't feel my teeth. <laughs> Busted! I knew you weren't a guidance counselor. Ah! Hi, Karnya Valet. Now with Queen Moon. My mom is Queen Moon. <laughs> Dad, Mom's here. Ah, Pie Carnival. Danger. Pie Folk. Pie Folk? Pie Folk. The sleaziest scammers in all of Muni. What may seem like a fun carnival is but a trap to take everything you have. Your horse, your carriage, your wedding ring. Did this, uh, happen to you? I was trying to win a boombox, but now they've taken my wife. Well, say what you want about the pie folk, but if Mom's here, I'm going. Honey, wait! Wear a money belt! She's doomed. Uh, whoa, 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 wait, wait a sec. Look, we've been questing for weeks, and I haven't had a proper meal. Let's get some food. You just touched my beard. Come on, man. You're like the hungriest guy I know. You gotta be starving, too. Of course I'm starving. I'm starving for my wife. <laughs> uh, we'll eat a proper meal at home after we find Moon. I'm just talking about a snack, dude. This place is full of pies. Full of pies? <laughs> full of lies? You, you have food? River? Is that a drumstick? <laughs> Can I, uh, can I get one of these pies? The 650. Wait, 
$6.50 or $650? I don't care I'm hungry, but you better throw in a napkin. Marco, no! I told you not to eat the pies! They're stuffed with nothing but balderdash and humbug and hamala! I'm on to you. Look, man. I'm eating this pie. Huh? Oh my gosh, Nachos is in trouble. I gotta save her! Whoa, 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 where are you going? To the Never Zone! And then maybe to talk to Hecapoo about telling me when she loses my dragon cycle? Wait, you're going to that weird future dimension where you're all buff and rugged? I am in! Uh, I don't know, Star. I went through some really tough times in that place. It's more treacherous than other dimensions. Right, 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 right. Yes, I see your point, but consider abs. Ugh, okay, fine. Abs dimension. The Never Zone is on the other side of the afflicted forest. We'll never make it there on foot. Oh, so many cloudy charms. No, we can't fly here. There's wild lightning roaming the trees. Yeah, that lightning looks pretty wild. Oh, is that a fairy? <gasps> Marco Diaz! The fairies here are just like mosquitoes, but they make a great summoning charm. That's Brunzetta. We quested together for a while. Oh, so you mean quested or like quested? Marco Diaz! <laughs> As I live <gasps> and breathe. <laughs> Good to see you, old friend. <laughs> Who's this? Brunzetta, this is my best friend, Star. Oh! <laughs> Yammy here told me all about you. Yammy? Oh, one time, Marco insulted a necromancer's cooking. He got turned into a yam for a whole year. Brunzetta, now's not the time. We need a ride to the Never Zone. Right. I heard those savages got nachos. You gonna give them El Chapo? What do you think? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Classic Yammy! And then there was this time we fought a giant scorpion made entirely of skulls. I was just about to chop its head off when Yammy got the brilliant idea to light it on fire. <laughs> How was I supposed to know that fire makes it stronger? Wow, Marco. You've never told me about any of these adventures. It's not all adventure, Star. There's a lot I want to forget, but I can never forget the Never Zone. <laughs>